Well, what is going on guys? PTS42 here, and welcome back to At Dead of Night. What's that? The accent. You, you don't like the accent. Okay. Um, you know, I, I just thought it was fitting, considering, you know, where this game takes place and all. But you don't, you don't like it. Are you sure? I, I can't twist your arm about this. <laughs> No, it's it's fine, fine, fine. Hey, hey, what? Uh, at, at dead of night, yes. Um, uh, part two. Uh, that's what we're doing. In the previous episode, we really didn't make too much progress. Okay, we ended up contacting Amy, which is the spirit on the ground floor, the lowest ground floor of the hotel. And now I think we need to find some uh, m more items. We need to find more items to ask Amy about so she can give us more information on Jimmy. That's that's pretty much as far as we got last time around. But if for some reason you actually haven't seen the previous episode and you want to watch it and catch up, there will be a link in the description and up in the card section to the first episode. So definitely go watch that if you want to be caught up for this episode. But before we go ahead and hop into the video, guys, I need to go ahead and say we recently, and I mean very recently, just hit 4,000 subscribers, okay? And I just want to take a moment and thank you guys for all of the support on the videos that you've been showing recently, and it really, really does mean the world to me. But if you're watching this video and you're not actually subscribed, you should consider subscribing. If you enjoy my content, enjoy my videos, and you want to see more from me on a regular basis, that's the best way to do it. So the things that we need to do this episode, number one, we got to find this mirror, okay? So I'm going to head off to the elevators right here and we are going to search every floor in this hotel every room on each floor individually just to see what items we can actually find because we can't make any progress unless we find these items so we're gonna go ahead and call the lift and I think we're gonna start on the first floor now the first floor is the floor that I've explored the most and considering that the second floor is pretty much inaccessible like there's nothing on that floor that I can actually explore at least without finding some sort of light source so this is where we're gonna start now hopefully Jimmy is not on this floor so we're gonna start with room 101 through 115 and then head back to the elevators but let's see um see what items we can find make our way over here first door Room 106. Okay, so we're starting at 106. Gotta remember that. Take a look over here. Now, I'm pretty sure... Okay, we have a compass here, which we already have, but... I think I can search different drawers in each room, which I did not know. I thought that I could only search one, but as we just learned, that is not the case. So, there's probably a bunch of items that I missed in every single room. Ooh, I don't like that sound. Okay. Jimmy's here now. Am I gonna die? No! Oh, oh, this is not good. Oh! This is bad. He's coming in. This is the only place I can hide because it's so dark in this room. There's no way he doesn't get us right now. There's no way. No way. The door hasn't shut yet. Okay. I don't know how we survived this encounter, but we freaking did. All right. Look through the spyglass. Just to make sure. Just to make absolutely sure. Oh, God! Oh, I don't... This is not good. This is not good. He's patrolling the area right now. Nope, not what I wanted. Crap. Oh my god. No! Go! Just book, 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 book. Turn. Get in. Get in. I don't care. I don't care. Just get in the freaking room. Oh my god. That was a mistake and a half, dude. Oh my goodness. Search the drawer. All right, this is where we found the paddle and the whiskey. What about this side? The mirror! Oh, thank you! Reveals hints and clues when used in dark places. Perfect. Okay. You can only use the mirror when the icon is visible. Either by the door in the rooms or the ground floor kitchen. Use the mirror to see clues about where to go or which items to use next. Heck yes, dude. Let's go ahead and use the mirror for the first time. 
and see what we need to do next. There's Jimmy. There's Amy. Okay. One on one. Oh, God, why did that scare me? Room 101. That's our room, right? That's the room that we were booked in and staying in. We need to go to room 101, apparently. So I guess since we're on the first floor, that's where we're going to try to go. Let's see if we can't find ourselves room 101. The thing is, I'm still going to check the other rooms as well while I'm here. <laughs> oh! Jimmy. Jimmy, why? Not cool. I lost my spirit box and my compass. No, I got my compass. I lost the spirit box and I do have, still have the mirror. So we need to go get the spirit box back. He sounds so close. He sounds so freaking close, dude. We found some drawings. Okay, peep the sword. Peep the sword, dude. Okay. Those two things have to be connected, I'm sure. 101 and 115. 106 was over there. So 101 should be here? Yeah, room 101, we finally found it. Cool. All right, moving to the room. So there was something here that we clearly missed last time. You found a chef's hat, okay. And we found a bottle of turpentine and a lighter. Okay, I don't know, that's probably flammable. We did find a key. Deadlock key for 121, okay, and nothing. We found some good items here, though, for sure. We're going for it. Screw it. Screw everything. Screw everything. Go, go, go. Get in. Yes. Okay, we made it to the freaking storeroom. My god, that was way too intense. Give me my freaking ghost box. And now that we have this, what do we need to do? Probably go talk to Amy, right? So we're going to go down to the base floor. Down to the base floor because we know Jimmy cannot come down here. So we are safe for the time being. We need to find a dark place where we can use uh, the mirror to tell us what we need to do next. I think it says something about the kitchen. So I'm going to head over towards the kitchen and try using it over here. Let's use it. Use the mirror, baby. What we got? Pouring something on a toy? On a bear? Is that the next item we need to find is a bear? Oh, you know what I bet... It's the, uh, the, the one thing that we found in room 101, the, with the lighter and that, that weird liquid. My guess is that Jimmy lit her bear on fire or something. That's my guess. Let me see if Amy is still in the arcade. I think that's a good idea. Let's see. Is anyone there? Hello? Now that we're in contact with Amy, I need to ask her about this, uh, turpentine. What were they for? Jimmy showed you. Okay, let's add the stealing from Amy and the lighter and the turpentine to the pair and ask if they're linked. Does that have something to do with what you said about the turpentine and lighter? All right, I knew it. Okay. Oh, we got something else. Another hallucination of the bear. We kind of saw this in the mirror too. All right, ground uh, floor number one. And did we just lose contact with Amy? I think we did. I don't want to go back to the first floor because that's where Jimmy is. <laughs> and he's going to freaking kill me again. Take all my keys, mate. He's going to take all my keys, gamers. All right, let's check out room 116. We can uh, see if I missed anything in this room. But wait, no, I've already been here. This is where we found the sword. Okay, but it doesn't matter because we can at least use the mirror in here. So we have Amy, and we know everything that we're doing has to do with Amy. Room 109. There we go. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Okay, we're going to head to room 109. 109 should be over here. Yep, room 109. Okay, we found it. Right? Room 109 was where we were supposed to... <gasps> Oh my god! I did not expect that. Okay, Amy. Now we gotta talk to Amy. She's gotta be in here. Alright, we're in contact with Amy. Well, I guess we should just ask her about the toy on fire. I saw you holding a toy on fire. What happened? What happened, Amy? My hand got burned. It was really hurting. I couldn't tell anyone. That stinks. And we have another hallucination. All right, floor one, sword. 
We ha we've seen the sword already, though. I. All right, maybe the second floor now? Did I lose contact with her? I really hope I didn't. I know it's on the second floor, apparently, which I can't really explore because I don't have a light source, or I don't even know if we need a light source or not, but let's try using the mirror and see if I can get a better idea of where to go. We know it's on the second floor, right? Or maybe it's on the first floor. I don't know. I saw one and a two. Okay, knight. Remember the armor. Armor. That's got to be important. The armor stand. Oh, who is that? Who are you? Maybe another spirit, potentially? The armor's- Okay, this is where we need to be, but I need to hide for the time being. I need to hide, because Jimmy's close. I just need to play it safe, but we found the armor stand. That's gotta be where Amy's at. I'm gonna- I'm, I'm gonna just go for it. Um, let's go back towards the armor stand. Open it up. We're by the armor stand. Ask a question. Oh! Total change in attitude right there. What? You know that Amy's scared outside of the room. 102, and Jimmy's close too. All right, let's see if we can't get this thing done, okay? Move into the room, spirit box, turn that junk on. Come on, Amy, you've gotta be here. There she is. All right, finally, we got contact. Okay, we have to ask her about what we just saw. Trying to find a doctor about what? Her being when scared. When you said you needed a doctor, but Jimmy threatened you to stay. Does that have anything to do with what you said about the sword? Hopefully. Yes. Oh, yes, it is. Okay. And how did he do that? And we got another hallucination. Dude, finally. Okay. All right, Jimmy. What did you do? Maybe that's what the, the lighter and the turpentine are for. I don't know what turpentine is. Sorry, I, I just don't, I don't know. Where do we go from here? How do we move on? Let's check it out. And then I'm gonna try to use the mirror one more time. Just, just to see if it works. It might be on cooldown. Okay, it's not. All right, let's look at the mirror again. This mirror is so useful. I, that, that cannot be stressed enough. I'm sure it's gonna tell us that we need to go up to the sec- 112, no. Okay, 112 is the next room we need to go to. Room 112. Let's check out room 105. See if we got anything going on in here. Check the uh, little drawers we got. We found an old cloth covered in blood stains. Okay, at least that's a new item. And we found a syringe. Th this has got to be what Jimmy was referring to with Amy to, you know, make her, her hands st stop hurting, right? That's got to be an important item. All right, I'm going for it. I'm going for it. All right, we saw him over there, so we're going to book it the other way. I think it should... It's this way. The la... The, the, yep, right here, dude. The freaking lights are flickering. Amy is here. Amy is with us right now. Another mirror here. Oh my gosh, Amy. Oh, he made you drink something. It was probably alcohol. Remember what Amy said about alcohol? All right, I saw you let's ask something. her. We gotta you ask her what it was. It. What was it? The boy told me it was medicine. It tasted horrible. Yeah, I think we can uh, we can gauge what Jimmy uh, made her drink, right? Let's pair those together and when ask. You said the medicine tasted horrible. Does that have anything to do with what you said about the whiskey bottle? Because the alcohol is in this room too. Maybe. She told me to keep drinking it. It makes sense. Horrible. Yeah. But then I to he made her drink alcohol. Dude, I am pairing these connections up like a boss right now, okay? You can't lie about that. What do we got here though? I don't know what I just saw. And we lost our connection with Amy once again. Let's go ahead and use the mirror again, because it'll give us a, a vague idea of where to go next. What is this mirror gonna freaking tell us right now? Third floor. Okay, let's see if we can make our way towards the elevator, which I think is actually gonna be back this way. Are you standing on that corner, Jimmy? 
He's standing on that corner. That's for freaking sure. Stairs are this way. Come on. To the stairs. We're taking the stairs. We're taking the stairs because Jimmy can't go on the staircase. Go, 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 go. Woo! Uh, we want to go down. We're going to the base floor because that's where we're safe, okay? I need to collect my thoughts. On to the ground floor we go. Perfect. Okay. Let's we'll go over towards the front desk. Woo! My gosh, dude. Okay, I need to check. How, how much progress have we made this episode? How much? 15%! Oh, baby! We went from 4% from the last episode to 15%. Guys, I'm starting to get the hang of this game right now. All right, we're doing pretty solid. So it looks like the next thing we need to do is go back up to the third floor, at least if we want to continue Amy's story. And I think that's the way I want to try uh, to do these videos is try to focus on one spirit at a time because otherwise things are just going to get way too complicated. Now, I don't know exactly what we need to do on the third floor. All I know is that we need to go up there and find some sort of clues or more items that'll help us with Amy's storyline. But I think that's just about all the time that I have for this episode, you guys. And I'm ridiculously happy with the amount of progress we made this episode. I really do hope you guys are enjoying this game so far because I am enjoying this a lot, okay? Now that I have a good understanding of the mechanics and how to deal with Jimmy and how to deal with the spirits as well to, you know, progress the story, it's very, very good. And I, I'm really enjoying this game. I really am. But if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more like it, definitely be sure to leave a like on this video. And if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss a thing. But with all that stuff said, you guys, I will see you in the next video. So until then, keep on being stellar. Wow.